Oh, this is a good shot. Hi, everybody. Let me know when you're here. Thank you, Dakota. All right, everybody. It is Wednesday. It is time for the catacombs. It is high noon here in Arizona. It is hot. It is humid. And hopefully we'll get some rain soon. Got me some 7-Up. Uh, uh, pardon me. All right, guys. We got a really great uh, celebration coming up this Friday, June 24th. We are doing the Stephen Butler Artist Celebration. So I cordially invite you guys. I'm going to show you guys some of the additions we are offering. And uh, yeah, and let you guys know uh, some of the fun things we got coming up. I'm um, probably going to try to go through a little quick because I got to get a lot of stuff prepped for uh, San Diego coming up. Eric Hart, hello, you beautiful man. How are you? It's good to see you as always. Um, I say it's been uh, real crazy. We've got a lot going on here. We've got um, stuff coming in for uh, La Muerta that we are QCing. Uh, Q -suing, Q -seeing, and uh, get everything all set up, put together, and sent out your way. So, really hectic, really busy, but hey, this is what you expect from HQ because we do it all for you. All right, hey, I got my fingers down right. Hey, hey what's up, Kenneth? How are you today, man? It's good to see you. Good to see you. I hope the week is treating you right. Hope everyone's having a beautiful week. We're almost done with the week. We're heading our way to the weekend. So I want to get things started on Friday, this Friday, coming up, June 24th. Um, ow, why is this not working? There we go. We will be doing a Stephen Butler Artist Celebration. Now there's going to be some really beautiful additions that I'm going to show you today that... Um, I'm excited, and if you caught the show on Monday, Brian let's, uh, revealed that the art I'm about to show you today is stuff he's been sitting on since the 90s. So this is art that Brian's been holding back for a special occasion, and that occasion is today as we celebrate Stephen Butler. Again, these uh, editions will go live Friday the 24th, 9 a.m. for all you Sworn Club members, and... 10 a.m. for the general public. All right, now here's a little history about Mr. Butler. Uh, he's a fan favorite comic book artist who has worked for the major uh, publishers, uh, Marvel Comics. He worked on Web of Spider-Man, Silver Sable, and some other popular titles. Over at Archie's, he was a very long-running artist over what I feel is probably the most successful um, video game comic book related uh, character, Sonic the Hedgehog. Now, there's a lot of people that were really devoted to that series, and I am proud to uh, know quite a few of them. Uh, they've been collecting it since uh, the beginning of the series, uh, in around 93, 94, and a lot of them still continue to this day. And it's great to know that Stephen Butler will be here, and I'm excited to talk to him uh, next week. So we'll have an extended Wednesday show. I'll be dropping in some stuff from the vault for uh, July 4th, as well as some vault items for uh, Mr. Butler, as well as a uh, fun little Q&A, kind of get a history and everyone gets to know him. So that'll be next Wednesday, and it'll be uh, probably a slightly longer show, so I'd like to invite you guys all to join me here on the Sworn Nation. All right, here we go. Let's start things off with what he will be presenting, and these go live, again, Friday the 24th. Let's start it off with Lady Death Cataclysmic. Majesty, this is the Rejoice Edition. It's $25. It is limited to just 100 serial number copies, and there will be limits. I believe it's two or three. Uh, Jimmy, if you can post the link if you are able to. Hey! Okay, there we go. Hi. Thank you, Jimmy. Man, Jimmy's on top of things so fast. So, any duplicate orders will be canceled, so please... Respect everyone's issues. Let's try to get as many of these copies in people's hands. Now, I really love this, and this is great. I mean, look at all the detailing in the backgrounds. Let's make sure I'm showing this off right. I really love the demon in the background. You've got all these demons flying in the moon. Mm, excuse me, I got the burps. Too much seven up. But yeah, this will go live. $25 limited to 100 serial number copies. And we will be setting aside remarks for those as well. All right. So for the artist celebration specials, there's are some things you should know. Stephen Butler and Brian 
will be doing signatures for free on these books. Also, a limited number of Stephen Butler remarks will be available on select items for a $30 upcharge. So you can get double signatures and a remark. Now this is very limited quantity, so uh, get those fingers ready. Now again, these exclusives will launch at 9 a.m. for Swarm Club members. So that is gonna be 9 a.m. Pacific on our East Coast friends, that will be 11 a.m. The general public gets to get these editions at 10 a.m., which is noon time East Coast. <laughs> Anyways, and uh, yeah, we expect to have these items shipped out by July 15th, so that's a pretty quick turnaround. Let's get back to these beautiful editions we're offering. This is Cataclysmic Majesty Rejoice Hollow Foil. Absolutely beautiful. Let me see how this looks on camera. I flipped my camera upside down, so it's a little weird for me to look at. This edition will cost you $80. It is limited to 66 serial number copies, and there will be limits, so definitely check on them below. We definitely want to make sure everyone has a chance. Now, the um, regular edition, it looks like we have a limit of three on these. Hollow foil, probably one because we got a really 66 serial number copies. These will go fast. And like I say, there will be limited quantities of certain editions available with a remark when we go live with these, so make sure you get it. Again, this is the Rejoice Hollow Foil, $80, 66 serial number copies. This item will go live on Friday. All right, and we got a lot of really great metal editions. This is the Rejoice Metallic Edition, it's $110. There's only gonna be 30 serial number copies and it's a limit of one copy per customer, per household. Thank you, Jimmy. Everybody, round of applause to Jimmy. Um, he's always on top of it, answering your questions while I do these live shows. And to be honest, it's uh, impossible to imagine what it was like doing them without Jimmy's support. So thank you, Jimmy. All right, here's the next edition that will go live on Friday. This is Treacherous Infamy Relish Edition. And this is going to be $25, limited to 100 serial number copies. And it looks like there is a limit of three per customer, per household. All duplicate orders will be canceled by Brandy. She keeps an eye on this stuff. She really does. She's, she's, she's sharp. So again, $25. This goes live Friday, 9 a.m. for Swarm Club members, 10 a.m. for the general public. And here is the Relish Hollow Foil Edition. Wow. Breathtaking. Again, these are, like I said earlier, these are items that Brian's been sitting on for almost 30 years. Uh, this is $80. It's going to be uh, 66 serial number copies. And I believe, let's double check my limits on this. It'd be a limit of one per customer per household. So get them while you can. This is very limited. They will sell out. I highly predict sellouts on these. And this is really great. I think, um, I'm glad we sat on these. Because um, a lot of you who may be used to Stephen Butler as the king of doing all the homages for us. Well, here's what his original stuff looked like. And I want to see more of that here at Coffin Comics. This is the Relish Metallic Edition, $110. Uh, limited to 30 serial numbered copies. This is a metal cover. This is the mock-up. Again, this item will go live. Ready? Live this Friday, 9 a.m. for Storm Club members. 10 a.m. for the general public. It pays to be a Swarm Club member. All right. It's my civic duty to show you this booty. This is Blast the Anthem Adoration Edition. Again, 25 copy, co copies. Co copies will be made. 100 serial number of copies. Limited to three per customer per household. 25 De Niro is what it will cost. And I think I just heard Brandy laughing in the background at me. Thank you, Brandy. Thank you very much. Love you. <laughs> you know, I have to say, um, we've got so much going on that Brandy's just like, boom, boom, boom. She's just directing on like a general should. All right, here we go. This is the Adoration Hollow Foil Edition. All right, $80, limited to 66 serial number copies. 
there will be limits upon it. So make sure you jump in when it goes live Friday, 9 a.m. for Sworn Club members and 10 a.m. for the general public. Being a Sworn Club member really counts because you can get those exclusive editions that we launch usually a couple a month. You get early access, so get it, got it, good. This is Blasphemy Island. This is the Adoration metallic version, or edition, excuse me. Uh, 30 serial number copies, $110, limit one per customer per household. These will go fast. I think this is the uh, smallest um, print run for metals I have ever uh, seen in my time here that wasn't part of a Kickstarter, so this is pretty exciting stuff. Ooh. I think this, this is gorgeous. This is Sorrow, Malevolent Decimation. Again, $25. This goes live Friday, limited to 100 serial number copies. Limit three per customer, per household. Get them, get them, get them, get them. These have been sitting. Brian has been sitting on this art for almost 30 years. He is releasing it here for the first time. The first time we are offering this art. This is classic Stephen Butler. And I'm wondering what other cool things Brian has up his sleeves. I mean, if he's been sitting on the, these art images for that long, makes you wonder what other cool things he's got coming up. I don't know. I'm looking forward to it. This is the Levelant Destination Sorrow Hollow Foil Edition. Be still my heart. Look at this. Look at this. $80, limited to 66 serial number copies, limit one per customer per household, and get them. These are gonna go fast, absolutely fast. This is absolutely beautiful. And then I'll, like I say, some of these editions will be offered with a remark for an extra charge, and you can get a double signature from Mr. Butler and Brian Polito for free. Again, these items will go live Friday. And here is the final comic edition I have for you today. This is the Sorrow Metallic Edition. Again, like the others, $110. There's only going to be 30 serial number copies, limit one per customer per household. And we have Metallic cards. Yes, we do. Yes, we do. Gary Compton's probably uh, excited because there's four new images for him. What we have here is this is the Adoration Metallic card. It's limited to 66 serial number copies, ladies and gentlemen. Only 66, $12, and this goes live. Coffin Comic Shop, 9 a.m. Sword Club members, 10 a.m. for the general public. All right, this is the Metallic card for Relish. Again, 66 serial number copies, $12 is the cost. And like the other things I've been showing you previously, this will go live on Friday. Woo, here we go. This is Rejoice Metallic card. Just like the other 66 serial number copies, $12 a piece, and they are limited. 66, as I said before. I'm trying to stop my computer from going to sleep. Dude, Ace, why you still got to tease me about the weather, yo? Why? Why? Say, if you got clouds or anything, send them our ways. We need some rain down here in uh, the valley. And here's the metallic card for sorrow. Again, the artist is Stephen Butler. Very beautiful image. Limited to 66 serial number copies, $12. And this is available on Friday. Sworn Club members, 9 a.m. General public, 10. All right, we also have prints we are offering. These will run you $16. God, look at these, breathtaking. $16 for the prints. Woo, look at that. So beautiful, 11 by 17 prints. This would be great. Get them signed. Here we go. Oh, look at that adoration. Yes, there's a lot of people admire, ad adoring this. <laughs> $16. And there is also a print set where you can get all four for an amazing price. Let me go ahead and break down that price for you. For the print set, you can get all four. And my computer just doesn't want to do the walking today. Here we go. All right. Da, 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 da. Do, 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 All right. The print set, all four prints, $48. That is a really great value. So you're into prints, Gary Compton, I'm looking at you. Four print set, $48, and there is four metallic cards. It's a really great opportunity um, for you guys to check it all out. Again, 
let me reiterate that some of these additions will be available. So Stephen Butler and Brian Polito will sign your books for free. A limited number of, of remarks will be available for select items with a $30 upcharge. So usually we do like four or five-ish for remarks. So these will go quick. We're trying to, uh, Brandy also keeps track of it so she makes sure someone's not hoarding everything. So Brandy's really on top of it, so don't think you can fool her. So again, these are all the beautiful editions we will be selling this Friday, 9 a.m. for the Swarm Club members, which will be um, uh, noon for our, actually, no, that is not correct. Because of the time zones, I am making a very big boo-boo and I don't wanna do that to you. Okay, Swarm Club members, it's 9 a.m. 11 a.m. Central and noon Eastern. Okay, I was right. For the general public, these items that I just showed you will go live at 10 a.m., which is uh, 12 p.m. Central and 1 p.m. Eastern Daylight Time. So get ready, because this is going to be a mad rush, and I hope you guys can get it. The Metal Demon? Heck yeah, I will. Let me know if anyone else would like to take a look at any of these editions so I can show you. All right, Eric, I take your looking at that beauty right there. This is the Rejoice Metallic. Absolutely beautiful. $110. And, like I say, it's limited to 30 serial number copies. Yeah, isn't it beautiful? Dude, I'm glad I get to show you. Like I say, guys, in the comment, if there's something else you would like to see, please let me know, because I'm getting ready to roll on over to the catacombs. So, before we do that, let me see if there's anything on here. It is, I agree. Um, when Brian brought in these editions, the mock-ups, um, I have to say, um, we were like, whoa, you know, the only Stephen Butler item I'm familiar with that we had printed in the past, um, I wanna say was uh, Skulls. And I believe all we have is a mini print left. And it's her sitting on the little pile of skulls with a Black Widow covering her uh, nipples. So that was the only one I was familiar with. So when Brian presented these, you know, I'm used to Butler as an homage artist. I'm really excited um, for these covers. I, we all in the office all agree that these are great and we are definitely looking forward to seeing uh, what other uh, stuff he's done that are uh, not homages, but original art. Absolutely beautiful. So those editions, again, will go live Friday, 9 a.m. for Sword Club, 10 a.m. for the general public. If you guys have any further editions, oh! Oh my God, Stephen Butler's watching me. You, Stephen Butler, you're the guest of the show, so you can call me whatever you like. Just don't call me a can you hear mom? I had to bleep that out. <laughs> um, Mr. Butler, it's, it's worth it. These editions are absolutely stunning. Um, it, Mario and um, Jimmy and I um, Saw them and we were like, holy cow. Showed them around to the other people. Yeah, Coop, the resident badass, was really, really enjoying them too. So we're really excited to present these editions and, you know, show you guys uh, another aspect of Butler's art. So Stephen Butler will be with me next week. We'll do a little extended catacombs. I'll be uh, presenting some July 4th uh, vault items as well as some vault items I have uh, for Stephen Butler. So uh, I look forward to you guys joining us uh, next week. All right, everybody. I've got some really great stuff for you here in the catacombs. Let's go ahead and start things off right. I have for you, these are the last single copies I will have for the Lady Death Enchantments Mike DeBalco Sworn Fest. These are all the nice copies. These are the last of the last. Once they are gone, that is it. They are gone. Um, we'll have to see if I have vault copies. So get them. These are live right now. Thank you, Dakota, for getting everything um, up and ready to go. All right, and I got the last two copies of Lady Death Sworn. This is the Sworn Metallic Edition. Absolutely breathtaking. We did present a Sworn 2 edition, a complimentary piece to go with this. Um, during a campaign, a couple, uh, God, it's been a couple months, it's probably been a year knowing that how fast things go. Um, but this was really beautiful. I'm glad we made this into a metal edition. Um, so scoop them up. These are the last copies I have for you today here on the Catacombs. All right. Looks like I got three copies. All right, Mad Mike fans, these are for you. This is 
Catac uh, Cataclysmic Majesty, Mad Might Kill Fist Edition. These are the last copies available. These are the last ones available. So come get them because they are going to be sold out soon. Heck yeah, heck yeah. Also, if there's anything in the catacombs that maybe drops off, reach out to me. If I have it, I will uh, see what I can do for you. All right. Oh, God, I absolutely love these. Love these. Uh, this is Lady Death Sworn. This is the vintage Marine Corps edition. Monty Moore. Uh, this is a really uh, great uh, promo we were doing uh, all of last year to celebrate the uh, anniversary of the armed forces here in America. So this, this is really beautiful. Uh, Monty Moore is the artist. He also did a vintage army, um, vintage Coast Guard, uh, Air Force. He did them, and they're absolutely beautiful, especially if you're a fan of old uh, 1940s, 50s style pinup art, because he absolutely captured it brilliantly. All right, next up I have for you the last copies of Lady Death Secrets. This is feel good. Oh yeah, that, that nurse comes into your uh, room. Are you gonna feel good or are you gonna cringe? I don't know, it might be a little both, but all I know is this is hot. And these are the last copies available now on the catacombs. All right, oh, another one, very popular um, edition. This is again, David Harrigan, this is Lady Death Secrets Shout edition. And this is homaging the uh, Motley Crue Shout album. So we've uh, done some a lot of fun homages over the years. We've done like movie posters and comics and uh, we're doing some music stuff, homaging some of our uh, favorite metal bands. So uh, yeah, these are the last copies I have for you folks today here on the Catacombs. Oh, we continue on today. So I should just call today uh, David Harrigan Day because we had a lot of great Harrigan stuff. These are the last copies of Lady Death Echo Ritual Mask Edition. Again, this is the uh, original version we had. She did not have the mask. So these are almost like the 2.0 versions of the uh, Ritual Edition. So this is Ritual 1 Mask Edition. What I have on the catacombs is all that we have left. All right, here we go some more. This is Lady Death uh, Revelations Iron Death Edition. These are the last copies of these. Again, this is another um, giving a salute to Iron Maiden. So get these. These are three copies that I have left. And once they are sold out, that is it. I am sold out in the Deutsch. All right. Ooh, hey. Here we go. Jesse Witchford fans. These are the last remaining copies of Lady Death Cataclysmic Majesty, the Metallic Jewel Edition. Looks like I got about three, four copies. And once those are gone, that's it. They are sold out. So make sure you scoop them up. Make sure you get them for you. And add them to your collection today. And let's see what else I have. Okay, a couple more things. I have a scratch and dent for Lady Death Damnation Naughty Edition. This is the Comic Shop Market Edition. And that is available today, right now. So that's everything I got for you folks today. I want to say personally, thank you everyone for joining me today. I gotta to get back to it, get everything ready for these. Uh... Yes, the three we met. You have a question about three uh, the things. Uh, those cards. Yes, the metallic cards. Uh, just so you know, Ace, to answer your question. Um, they are the same size as a baseball card, trading card, Pokemon card. They're exact same size. Yeah, it would fit nicely in a uh, nine, pa nine pocket uh, binder pages. Um, if anyone's familiar with uh, card collectors, uh, there's three ring binders you put your cards in. The metallic cards should fit in those nice and neatly because they are designed just like a regular trading card. I hope that answered uh, your question, Ace, about the metallic cards. But yeah, they should all fit in a uh, three wing binder. I wouldn't mind Cop and Comics three wing binder. There's definitely people out there scooping up the cards, whether it be metallic, hollow coil, or whatnot, people actually love it. So that's a great idea, Ace. Um, yeah, I'll go ahead and put that out there. You just check out some things. Okay, guys, I just got a few minutes. I'm gonna wolf down some lunch and I gotta just continue on with some QCing for SDCC. Um, I just wanna say personally, thank everybody, thank you for joining me today. Join me next week when I'll have a very special guest, Stephen Butler, and we will have a bunch of really fun stuff for the vault as we hang out with Stephen and, you know, talk shop. I'm Julie the Hooligan. I will talk to you guys later. 
I am sworn to you, I am out. Also, don't forget, limited quantities, dual signatures, and a very limited amount of remarks on these Butler editions. Check you out later. Bye-bye, everybody.